Hey y'all, I'm Devin and I love DIY. I used to be a professional dancer and aerialist in Vegas and on cruise lines, but I've recently been promoted to being a proud mama and a creative coach. I'm producing DIY projects live each and every week to bring you the best tutorials, guests, crafts to cash instruction, and creative content. So grab your iced coffee and let's get started. Hey guys, welcome to DIY Projects Live. My name is Devin and today I'm going to teach you how to make a DIY smoker out of flower pots. So let's get started. All right, so I have some peelistic gasket and we're just going to outline the rim of both flower pots with this. And the point of the gasket is to be able to create a nice seal once we put the um, flower pots together so everything stays inside, it's perfectly sealed, and you get that wonderful smoky flavor. So the next part is you're going to pick which planter is going to be the top of the smoker and you're going to take a U-bolt and you're going to make a handle of it. So I'm going to drill two small holes with a little drill bit in my planter, minus the child there. And then we are going to do this in. Ready, Psyche? Yeah! Don't forget your eyewear. Let's do this. I just put a ceramic brick in. It's gonna prop up the charcoal grate a little bit better. And then my top grate, um, I'm also gonna add four different screws on each side just to make sure it doesn't like slam or like fall into, um, have my sausages fall into my charcoal. That'd be so sad. So as you can see, all I did was we put it in here to see where it fit. And then I took a Sharpie and just kind of marked underneath where I'm gonna drill through. And then I found a drill bit for the screws and the screws are just gonna hold it up so it doesn't kind of flip forward and I lose my sausages. All right, here we go. That's our cap. Okay, so last but not least, we're gonna drill some holes for ventilation. And I just have some corks that you're gonna shave down and plop them into the holes and that way you can like release them to kind of adjust the temperature and let the smoke out. I'm gonna do two holes in the top and then two holes in the bottom as well. Striker's getting in the planter. As you can see. Yeah. It's just your size. Okay. So we first are going to put the charcoal grate in the bottom on top of our brick. Then we're going to add our charcoal. You're going to want to use like starting charcoal and you probably need about half the amount I put in for six sausages. All right, now that our charcoal is super hot, we're gonna start adding the hickory chips to it, and we just soak the hickory chips in a bowl of water to make sure it smolders. Watch out, bud. Mmm, that smells really good. Can you smell it, babe? Take the grill 
gate and place it in. Then we're gonna take this little guy, put it on top. We're gonna go grab our sausages. The final step is we just have a little thing of tin foil and we're gonna punch our thermometer through and we're gonna put it in the top of the drainage hole here. All right, so we have our smoker heated up and I'm just going to put the sausages straight on the grill gate. So we have three hot sausages and three mild. And then you're gonna let them smoke for 45 minutes to an hour. Keep checking the temperature and then Bon appétit! Next week on DIY Projects Live, we are celebrating Earth Day with a marble planter DIY project.